we have a lot of things going on. Spring cleaning, Passover is almost here, so just getting ready for that. And we're just gonna bring you guys along. Yeah, we say spring cleaning, but the reality is it's still like- Winter. Very much winter outside. <laughs> April is here, time to get done. All of the stuff that is piled up and built up over the winter. We better get started. So I just went through everything here and got all of the leavening agents out. And now I'm gonna go through my chest freezer. I don't think there's any leavening in here, but it could really use some organization. So if you aren't familiar with Passover, basically it's focusing on getting the sin out of your life. So this week, sin is represented by leaven, which is baking powder, baking soda, yeast, anything that makes food rise. So I'm going to get all of that out of the house and do some spring cleaning in the meantime. <music> Okay, so there wasn't that much in there. This is all salmon. I have chicken, a whole chicken, beef, ground turkey, bacon, and I believe that's moose or bison. It's moose, it's moose. So now I'm just gonna put that all in and organize it a bit more so it's just easier to get to. Alrighty, well, while Mariah's working on cleaning the house, I am on car cleaning duty. On a work truck, which is very filthy. Our car is not too messy or anything, but we need to completely vacuum it out. Let's do it. So now I'm just going through all the cupboards, getting all the stuff out, wipe them out, reorganize them, put it back in. <laughs> issues with my cycle and things have gotten quite a bit worse so my doctor ordered me a transvaginal ultrasound which I am so excited for um yeah that's I, I'm sure you can imagine what that involves but I have that tomorrow and essentially I have to stop peeing at 245 and drink 32 ounces of water from 245 to 345 at 3.45, I have to check in at the hospital. My appointment, my technical appointment is at four and four to five is the procedure. And the whole time from 2.45 to five, I can't pee after drinking 32 ounces of water. And I'm kind of, I don't mean to be a wimp. I truly, truly don't, but I don't see how that's possible. Like, I pee all the time. I mean, we're talking every 10, 15 minutes because I drink a lot of water on a normal basis. I don't know how that's gonna go with me holding my bladder for that long after drinking so much water and then them putting pressure on my bladder. So this ought to be very interesting. Honestly, I just can't imagine the sheer pain I'm gonna be in, so. But I did double check to make sure Justin could be there with me for more support. So <laughs> hopefully they can figure out what's going on because I'm at a loss. Anyways, okay, well I have to go make dinner and the lighting in the kitchen sucks, honestly. It's really, really bad. So maybe I'll just do some more B-roll, who knows. <laughs> Well, 
Well, that's it. I'm finally done with the cars. Got that finished. Now we're going to go back inside, see Mariah, see what else needs to be done with the house. I think she may have gotten it all done, which is awesome. She's incredible. Hi, babe. Hi. I'm so glad you're home. <laughs> glad to be home. Dinner was ready, but I found that the rice was not, so now it's going to be another like 15 minutes. That is totally fine. Okay, real talk. That right there is our laundry, specifically our sheets hanging to dry because for whatever reason, even though the wash and dryer in this complex are new-ish, they got them like six months ago, they don't dry clothes even when you pay for it to dry. So this is... Our table situation right now so we aren't going to be eating there tonight thank you go babe we are spring clean de-leavened all of that and now we are um going on a mile-ish walk we uh, recently started something called a dopamine reset. There's different versions of, that, of it out there, but basically it's more about like habit resetting and trying to build some like healthier habits and whatnot. So one of the things we're doing right now this week is making sure we get out every evening and go for a walk together for a mile or so. And uh, it gives us a good chance to talk. I just want to know what our outfit difference is. Justin's flip flops and all. Mariah's warmth. Warmth. She's acting like this is a, a big deal. Like I'm dressed in flip flops. She normally wears flip flops because she can't handle not looking cute and summery. So she typically oh, always comfy. in like seven feet of snow. She'll wear <laughs> sandals. No. So I don't want to hear any. <laughs> Back no, talk I wouldn't about wear shorts and sandals. Sandals. What? I wouldn't wear shorts and sandals. Yeah, that's because you're cold all the time, though. Yeah. So for reference, it is April first or second, or something like that, and the snow is like hip height, which is pretty average for this time of year. But it's gonna be a long, long time until it melts, unfortunately. So for all of you spring people, this is our spring. All right, guys, well, we are going to end this vlog here. Thanks so much for coming along with us today. It was a busy little... <laughs> it was a busy one, but we made it. Now we're going to go to bed. Have a good week, and be sure to like and subscribe.